Hey guys, how's it going? Jordan, Location Independent. So what is an instant cash fund? Well, I'm about to tell you. One of my best friends, who is also into like making money in different ways and thinking outside the box, came up with this concept and he just made a blog post on it, which I'm going to link in the description below, called an instant cash fund. And basically, it's an alternative to having an emergency fund. And that's how he presents it. Now, I'm going to read you the introduction, and I'm going to give you my opinion on it, and uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Okay, so as much as you like looking at my beautiful face, let's minimize myself here, and I'm going to read you the intro. So, who needs an emergency fund? Forget the emergency fund. I got a better idea that will start generating more money for you. It's called an instant cash fund. Um, right now, without having a dime on my name, I have approximately 1300 in my fund and could access another 1300 next month. Yep, you heard me right. I don't have cash, but could access it instantly if I needed it for an emergency. And no, not talking about credit card cash advance with outrageous interest rates and fees. This is straight up cash, no strings attached. So what is an instant cash fund? Well, glad you asked because I've been using it for a few years now. My friend has, by the way. He's really good at this stuff. Um, so it's an imaginary fund where you can pull instant cash from when you need it. <laughs> Just kidding, but I sort of think of it that way. Basically, here's how I think about it. You can stash away 10 grand plus in an emergency fund and let it just sit there with extremely little ROI. Um, or you can use that money to invest in so many other things that will bring in more cash for you. And by the way, my friend, he didn't write this in this part, but my friend um, has done wonders with investing in real estate. Um, so that's kind of his, his game. And, uh, anyway, so he's thinking, you know, I'd rather have the money to invest in real estate or other, you know, other investments instead of sitting in an emergency account. Right. Um, but no one wants to feel left and left trapped in an emergency without cash. Uh, and that's why it says that in the first place. Um, so what if you could create a way to tap in, into instant cash when it is unexpectedly needed? Um, in that case, there would be no need to stash so much money away in a savings account. Replace your emergency fund with a side hustle. So this is what it comes down to. This is what he calls instant cash. It is a side hustle that pays out on demand. There are so many of them out there. Lyft, driving for Lyft or Uber, um, Amazon Turk, which is a bunch, for those of you that don't know, a bunch of uh, ways Amazon, like you do these little tasks for Amazon and they pay you. Um, they pay out uh, for those tasks on demand. Um, just to name a few, those are ways you can maintain a side gig with extremely little commitment, but at the same time can make some serious cash on the spot when needed. Um, okay, so now he goes on to say, yeah, he could, you know, those aren't his full time jobs. He actually has, he's a teacher, so that's his real job. But he can bust out 100 bucks in four hours uh, driving for Lyft or Uber if he had to. And he actually he has done this in the past. Um, okay, so what I think about this, I think it's a really cool idea and uh, something to keep in mind. Uh, I think it's a little bit extreme. I don't know if he was just kind of saying this just to have an exciting blog post to say, like, you don't need any emergency, you know, fund if you, if you have this fast cash source. Because um, I still think... You still need, you always need a little bit, no matter, you know, no matter what, even if it's like a thousand bucks or a couple thousand or something. Um, but ideally, you know, so in the ideal situation, you kind of would have as minimal as you're comfortable with of emergency cash uh, sitting in a bank account, because he's totally right that you earn very little interest just having it sit in an account. Now, I do have a way to earn up to, you know, like two and a half or even more percent interest. Uh, I have a resource. I did another video on that. I'll link to that below, too. A uh, really good uh, free online resource to show you the best online savings account interest rates. But before I digress too much, um, even 2%, 3%, it's, it's nice, but it's not going to earn you what something like real estate would earn you, or there's a bunch of other uh, investment strategies out there that'll earn you, you know, more. Um, so I agree with my friend that uh, it's best to have as minimal amount of money as possible in a savings account for emergencies, and then you also have more peace of mind knowing you can get instant cash from one of these side hustles, right? Lyft and Uber being perfect examples. Um, 
Yeah, so I hope that helps. And I'm gonna again, I'm gonna link to this. He goes into more detail because there's plenty more side hustle examples. Like he talks about his wife, and she teaches English uh, online, um, and that's another side hustle that she kind of does that on demand as well uh, for fast cash when when she needs it, right? So. Um, I'll link to that. Please give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you like instant cash, who doesn't? And think it's super important to have that along, if you agree with me, having that along with a uh, savings account just for a little bit of something, just held in cash uh, for a rainy day. And finally, I want to end with the fact that I have a free digital nomad cheat sheet, which has some free uh, online job resources and plus lots of other cool resources, tips and tricks, which you can get, again, in the description below, which I'm pointing at. Um, and I'm coming up with this crazy new, last thing I wanna say for now, you guys, you gotta check this out. This is like the biggest thing no one's ever done, as far as I know, something as big as what I'm doing, um, is a, a remote job resource that you can use to find exactly what he talks about, um, ways to find, you know, little side hustles and fast cash income streams as well as full-time jobs or resources on making your own uh, remote business and everything and anything in between. This is like the biggest resource. And uh, once you get my digital nomad cheat sheet, you'll also be on my e free email list, which um, everything, all that stuff is free, by the way. And I'm going to let you know as soon as that uh, remote job resource guide is out. Whew, okay, I had a lot to say. I haven't done a video in a while, so a lot of info to give you guys. Uh, hope all that helps. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in, in the next video. Take care.